for joining us today. Today we're going to be talking about going into and leaving an isolation room that is an airborne precaution. We're going to be talking about the correct procedures on how to enter, gown up, and disrobe. So come with me and we'll explore what we do next. So before going into a room, you're going to want to check the ball on the wall to make sure that the ball is inside. We do this to make sure that the seal is not broken in the inside. If it is, the inner door is most likely open. I can see this, the ball outside. Once the ball is inside, we can proceed to move in. Once we are inside of the ante room, we check to make sure the ball has come back inside the wall. This signifies that the room is now sealed and okay. It is now a safe room or a clean room. Next, we will show you how to put on your PPE or personal protective equipment. Okay? All of your PPE will be located in either this cabinet or a cart that will be located in this room with your PPE or personal protective equipment. First step is to put on gloves, one of two pairs. For the gloves, we put on our gown. We put it on covering our torso from our neck to our knees. You make sure they're covered from your arm to your sleeve. If there are gowns that have thumb holes, insert your thumb through the holes. Then we reach around and tie our gowns closed. Next, we apply our caps or our hair restraints. If you have longer hair, make sure that it's entirely inside of the cap. Following our hair restraints, we go to our booties. Make sure they're both on each foot. Next, we apply our N95 mask. If you are reusing a mask, such as this, remove it from your glad container. By re-putting it on, simply put it over your face and put the ties over your head and your neck. If you're putting it on for the first time, Make sure the bridge of the nose is fastened tightly to the bridge of your nose. This ensures a form-fitting seal. The bottom of the mask must be located underneath the chin to complete the seal. After we put the N95 mask on, we apply a surgical mask, blue side out. Following step is your face shield or goggles. Put it on top to make sure it's snug fit. Complete set. Once we are fully gowned in our PPE for airborne, we are now safe to enter. We're coming into the room for the first time. We will go into the closet where the biohazard mop is, and there will be two red bins located on the floor. Inside one of the bins will be red bags as well as a toilet brush for the bathroom. When we are ready to exit the isolation room, we follow in order. First, we remove our hair bonnet and our booties. Rolling as we go, taking the gloves with us.
point in time, you want to say a grip or a puncture in your first layer of gloves, the original sex. Use disinfectant as a hand hygiene order to remove any contaminants that may be in it. Next, we remove our goggles or our face shield. The front is contaminated. We remove it by the back straps. We take off the face shield, discard it into the red bit. Remove the surgical mask. Once again, the front of the mask is contaminated. We remove it by the straps discard into the red bit. With only your N95 mask and your second or original set of gloves, you now may exit the room. Once we are outside of the isolation room, into the ante room, you remove the original first set of gloves and discard them into the red bit. We then use hand hygiene, a sanitizing solution, and sanitize our hands fully and completely. Once our hands are sanitized, we remove the N95 mask. For additional use, we use our containers that have our names marked on them. The proper way to remove your N95 mask is put it over your face Contaminate the side to the bottom of the container. You then put the bands over the container. With your free hand, you may now lift your mask off and secure the container. We put them located here. Do not stack if they are going to be used again or have been used in an isolation room. Once we removed all of our PPE for an isolation airborne room, we are now okay to leave. Once we leave, we immediately wash our hands for a minimum of 20 seconds. Thank you for joining us and see you again soon. Remember, Stay safe.